Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel Mind Your Exam. So in this video, we will learn how to concatenate lists in our programming language. So suppose we have three lists named list A, list B and list C. Now list A contains three elements 1, 2 and 3. List B contains two values, the string MYE and the logical value true. And list C contains a single element which is a sequence of four numbers. Now, if I use the list function and pass all the three lists to this particular list function, then what will happen is the resulting list will create, will contain three new elements and those elements would be, the first element would be list A, the second element would be list B and the third element would be list C. But in case we want that the new list should have the elements that are present in each of these three lists as its individual elements and not the list as its elements. Okay. So now if we want to do this, that individual elements of these three lists should become elements of the new list. Then we use the C or the concatenate function and we pass the three lists to it. So what it does is it returns a sequence containing each of these elements that were present in the three list as its elements. So let's see the output of each of them. So suppose if I create this list first, execute this statement and only print the newly created list, which is list ABC underscore L that has been created using the list function. So here, when I printed list ABC underscore L, you can see this list contains three elements. The first element denoted by double square brackets one. Now within this element, three elements are present. The second element of this list is another list and the third element of this list is a sequence. Okay, so each of these elements is a list. Now when I use the C function to concatenate three lists and then I see the result, it will be very different from the first result. So in the second case, when I'm using the concatenate function, the output is again a list because we have used uh, the C function on individual list. So the output is a list and this list now contains more elements. The first element is one. The second element of this list is two. The third element of this list is three. So as you can see, the three and elements which were present in list A have become individual elements of the resulting list. Similarly, the two elements of list B have become individual elements that is the fourth and the fifth element of the resulting list and the single element, the sequence of four numbers that was present in the list C has become the sixth element of the resulting list. So this is how you can concatenate the multiple list, take elements from each of these lists individually and then give into a new list. So that's all for today's video. Thank you for watching. Till we meet in the next video. Mind your exam.